Now it's infected our children. It's driving up, driven up rates of stroke, cancer, and diseases of the mouth. And even when you hear all of that, it's near impossible to put down once you start. But one teacher at a middle school in Marshall County knows the odds and is declaring war against big tobacco. 7 News anchor Stephanie Grinley joins us right now to show us what sixth graders consider cool nowadays. Stephanie, did I read that right? Middle school? Yes, Stephen, it really does start that young. Moundsville Middle School is fighting smoking, and teacher Suzanne Muncy tells me that she let me into the classroom to see exactly how she's raising awareness. Do you personally know so many people who have been affected by smoking? Oh, absolutely. Everybody in West Virginia has a family member who smokes or dips. We're number one in spit tobacco and tobacco use in the whole, in the whole nation. It, it affects every family. There's there's not a family who doesn't tobacco doesn't affect them. So how do you make a dip in this trend? Well, our relatives might be a lost cause. It's not too late for the next generation of West Virginia. I can't tell you how they got a pig to smoke, but Suzanne Muncy can tell you touching the lungs, courtesy by the group Rays, is probably the biggest deterrent for middle schoolers picking up vape pens. These pig lungs make the lesson rather than watching a video or doing a worksheet or looking at a picture in a book and hopefully that will stick in their little brain and then they'll never ever do a vape, never start smoking or dipping. Since the inception of Ray's 20 years ago, the stats find smoking in West Virginian teens has drastically dropped, but vaping, well, that continues to be an upward battle. My kids think it's all cool, but it's not. It just like messes up your lungs. 12 is the average West Virginia age for kids to start smoking. Maddie and Carly tell me kids in their class smoke. Carly, maybe wise beyond her years, is talking about her fellow sixth graders. Yeah, that was pretty shocking to me. I didn't think they'd start that young. The lungs, along with the less formaldehyde filled items like the drawstring bags, water bottles, and t shirts, are all funded by Rays, and it's sticking. Moundsville Middle's Rays Club currently holds over 100 students. People think smoking's cool or vaping's cool, but it sounds like the cool thing to do is be a part of this club. What do you think? Yeah. I yeah. agree, yeah. The group just needs passionate people like Muncie to lead the charge against big tobacco. She tells me it's easy to join, and if you're interested, we'll have some resources linked on our website, WTRF.com. Live in the 7 Newsroom, I'm Stephanie Grinley, working for you.